selling Thai iced tea, especially Asian Thai iced tea. Uh, we're here at the farmer's market today, serving at Thai iced tea. And we have, we're actually opening a shop soon at Golden Shoe. So, do uh, check us out over there. The... <laughs> this is Bandung, this is a Bandung milk tea. So it's a special that we created for this event because it's a local event. Nice. So, yeah, but we might consider putting it in a, on, a, on a real menu for good. Mm. Yeah. Okay. This, this is Thai ice tea. It's really good. So do check their shop out. They are opening at Golden Shoe. Yes, go check that. See you. I'm with the lady behind Eastern Granola. You can tell us a bit more about Eastern Granola. We are kind of like popcorn. We are Eastern Granola in. from Edible Gardens uh, here at the Farmer's Market. Yeah, Bjorn, tell us a bit more about your Edible Gardens. Uh, yeah, I started, we started Edible Gardens two and a half years ago to, uh, to encourage urban farming in Singapore and to encourage people to grow their own food. Uh, so uh, we are social enterprise and um, um, two years down the road we have built about 20 gardens, herb gardens uh, around the city. Uh, and now we are working on like larger scale urban farms in the city as well. Uh, Hopefully to uh, you know create an industry where people can become urban farmers and make a living out of it. So that's really what we're trying to achieve in the next couple of years. Awesome! Thank you, Bjorn. Thank you. Horticulturist for plant visions and my concept of my business is you can grow food anywhere. Jimmy Oliver, I have been inspired by your program a lot and that's why it caused me to start this concept that everyone should grow a little bit of their own food and that every school should have an edible schoolyard.